Hey everybody, it's Kenzie Increase here from TG and Underground, and this is another one of those videos that I'm doing to get you guys to show support for TG and Arcade. This is one of the games that I just recently downloaded, which is a Warrior, uh, Warriors Orochi 2. I downloaded it off the Xbox Live Marketplace for 2400 points, I believe. And pretty much what I'm going to do is play the first level. Now, it's a long ass level, I'm going to tell you that now. And it's fun though. But as you see on the right side, we have three different types of characters. We have power, technique, and speed. You can switch between the three as you go throughout the level. And I knew, I know there's a, some way in the level that you can do triple team specials. I don't know how to do it. I've only barely heard about how this game plays, so I just decided to get it because I saw it. And I like the Dynasty Warriors games. And I currently don't have any on me at the moment, so I wanted to get one that I haven't played yet. Because I don't want to go out and buy seven again, because, well, I already played it and beat it. Anyway, the game's amazing. You know, I want to do something different. And this has the Dynasty Warriors characters and the Samurai Warriors characters in the same game. With that stated, it is from 2008. I did not know it was from that long ago, but it is. So now we are going to start, I guess, the story before the battle, I think this is technically called. The death yeah, the Serpent King this is, that's what it the is. The chaos that plagued the land seemed to have subsided. However, this newfound... Pretty much, was not destined the Serpent King Orochi was the villain in the first game. He was killed. His minions and other Orochi's evil people to are still out there the and the building armies and refuse to admit defeat. And what's going on is they're stirring up chaos around the land. With that stated, the uh, people I picked, which was Shu, because I always pick them first in any Dynasty Warriors game. And pretty much they go out and try to defend their land from the invading armies. And this level I will have Liu Bei, Guan Yu. I never thought the day would come and I have no idea who the chick is. The I am sorry. I haven't kept up on the new people in the game, so I am pretty bad at that. In 7, there was a crap load of people I didn't know who they actually were. And that makes me sad because I love Dynasty Warriors games. But the gameplay itself is pretty straight on. Exact. The There's no only difference is you can switch characters now and do like team specials or switch in the middle of a special or something like that. So in the level you will see I try to do it. Sorry, I'm yawning a lot for no apparent reason. I don't know why. But in the level you'll see me trying to switch. The pretty much you know get everything figured out and I still don't do it so I'm gonna have to look it up and figure out how to do it then I will make up a video showing you how with that stated I plan on playing this as more of a let's play slash guide I will show you how I beat the levels of while I play and this right now is the only one that I'm dubbing over my voice because of the fact that I was in a call and then I started playing without thinking so that's why I have everything. The video was set up ready to go, and I forgot to hang up the call and start up Audacity. So, yeah. And there's. That's the chick that I get to play as as well. She's the speed type. Lu Bei is the technique type. And Guan Yu is the power type. So, we're gonna go into battle and start switching between the two. Now, you use the triggers to switch left and right trigger depending on what character you want to switch to and as you see when I start out I'm very weak not used to this with Guan Yu I'm used to him being a lot stronger even at the beginning but you know what until I get my Chao it doesn't matter because Guan Yu will be the one I will use mostly now I have been you know in 7 I got used to playing as everybody because they switch you around and I do like playing as Lu Bei he is different in this game He's a little bit slower, but I don't mind it. And here is the other chick. Don't know what her name is, still. And I will find that out eventually, after 
I can start the game back up again and play. I will remember her name because, you know, from what it looks like, I have to use her. And as you see, you can switch mid-combo into somebody else. So, you know, it's really up to you, the player, on how you do things. I like the. If I have to get people away, I end up using the power character to knock them back. Then I'll switch to my speed character to take care of some people behind me. Unless it's like this exactly, where I'm surrounded by three people at level one. But one thing I will state is. When you're not playing as a character, they will regain their life, and they will regain their special bar. So use that to your advantage. Use the character that you can stay alive with longer, if you want to. And let the other ones get their special, swipe, switch them, and then use the special, and then use that to your advantage. That is one thing that I do a lot, after I realized they started doing that. The other thing I will state is, you know, don't forget to go to TG and Arcade and actually sub to it and you know post a comment on there or something right now it only has one video and we're working on reopening that so all the other thing to state if you guys want to be a director and you can get excellent quality on video that means use an HD PVR with your Xbox and PS3 and Wii and then record it record the arcade games that you download or other non AAA games that you download via the marketplace. Liquid Adhesive, you know, gave me permission to play this, just to sh give a shout out to Heejin Arcade, so, you know, with that said, that's why I'm giving it a shout out, and this is going up on Underground, because you are watching it on the Underground. So, you know, I just want to state that we're going to do a lot of cross promotion between the channels, and you will see us playing games together. And go, putting them up on both of them. And, you know, that's the one thing that we'll start doing is working together as a group of people. That can bring you more quality videos. And if it's a multiplayer game, you'll probably have, you know, dual com or tri com. And even if we have four people playing, it might be a quad com. And you might be able to see the gameplay from all different perspectives on different channels. Even our personal channels. So, with, you know, with that stated, I hope you all do go and check out TGN Underground, because you're currently watching this video under TGN Underground. Go check out MRE Gamers TV, and then go check out TGN Sports as well. Between those three channels, that's who we're going to be cross-supporting with via TGN Arcade. And again, if you feel you have the ability to to make quality videos, please, in the description, we will have the application form to join. We want you to post a YouTube link as unlisted in the application form as your submission video. And that right there will get it so you can apply. And if it's to the standard that we need, you will be accepted, and I will contact you personally. And talk to you about what the next step is. Now, one thing to note in this game is it is a very long, very long <laughs> match. I was hoping to get through the level in about 15 minutes. Not remembering how long Dynasty Warriors games can be. And well, they extended it pretty good in this one. They made it so that the levels themselves are bigger. Ugh, I don't know why I'm yawning so much, but I'm sorry guys, but they did, as you can tell they made the levels a lot bigger as you can see on the mini-map they have the Bar at the top which is the morale bar They have the timer right underneath that and then the map and then right below that is the kill count and Then to the left of that at the bottom is your character selection the one in the center is the one you're going to be using the one on the left or right side is the one you can switch to using the triggers, depending on how you want to switch it. Now, you know, with that stated, you got three different types of characters. As you see, I've been switching through them, and I've already explained what they are. But hopefully you can see the speed difference in them. The power character is a lot slower, 
when walking around and swinging the weapon, but their attacks are heavier. The technique is average. Technique also is the yellow color. I did want to mention that. Out of the three characters that I'm currently playing as right now, yellow is technique, red is power, blue is speed. Now, as it comes with the speed, you know, technique is faster than the power, of course. They have, I would say, the best balance of attack and speed power. And then speed is super fast. And you can do a lot of hits. That's how, how you pretty much tell them. They are blue. And as if you can look right now, look at the red circle around go on you. Look right up to the right of his head and you see that yellow bar filling. And you just saw it fill out. I switched over to Lube. And I'm currently trying to attack just to get used to everybody. And with that stated, you know, when you see the bars fill up it, because now that chick for uh, that's the speed type is filling up, you can see that fill. As soon as that fills, you can do your special combo. The way I figured out how to do it is hold down B and hit the trigger. Hold down B and hit the trigger. And make sure you hold down B because if you let go, you know, you stop doing a special and you just wasted it. So, you know, just pointing that out. And if you do time it right and you do get the... Thing working right, I believe your specials will do more power, and you'll be able to juggle the, the enemies and bosses a little bit longer. The controls are the exact same: A is jump, X is your light attack, Y is your heavy attack. Left bumper is block, or and readjust your camera. B is your special, and then right bumper is. I'm thinking like a power attack, but it uses your special. I don't actually understand how that works yet, but I will be looking it up and trying to figure out what's going on. This video is part of the Way Movement, a career path in video sponsored by TGN. To learn more, visit TGN.TV.